So I'm Pat Schendel and this is our home in Surrey. We've been here 40 years and I want to show you my studio. This is where I do my wheel work here and my carving. So my specialty is in crystalline porcelains. So uh, that's my passion and I continue with it to this day. So I'm going to show you a bit of the process. So first of all, you make your pots and these ones have been prepared and they're still drying and they will be mounted on a stand, a pedestal. Before you glaze, you have to wipe your pots down and then apply them by brush. But we want to know what is going to come out. So I have tested ahead of time and a good way to test glazing for crystallines because they're very fluidy is to have a saucer attached to them and just a dipping portion here where you dip them in the glaze and then fire them and see what you're going to get. So you have quite a variety here of crystals. Some are very distinctive, others are very subtle. And you can add oxides of different sorts to get what colors you like. They are going to behave differently on the vertical than on the horizontal. So it's good to make this kind of a test as well in a saucer so you know what's going to happen inside. These are just tiles and with these you have to be sure they don't run over the edge. So I've made these saucers ahead and they are bisque fired. Then I make a wadding material and roll it out and cut it in strips and into a circle. And that will go on to the base here and be glued on. And that's your catch basin. And then uh, it will hold the runoff of the glaze. So when they come out of the kiln, they, they have glaze running down over the sill and that has to be chipped off. So usually I warm the base first with a torch and then I take a little tool to try and give it a few taps and it usually comes off nicely. So then that has to be ground off. Here's your finished results here with a nice clean bottom and ready to sell. Now I'm going to take you into my kiln room. This is my scut kiln that I've had since about 1995. Still working well. So it has a computer programmer and this allows me to do the proper firing for a crystalline glaze. Thank you for watching my video.